Greetings in the name of Yahuwah and his son Yahusha Mashiach. My name is Malak Shalomo. Today is the 2nd of February 2024. It's 8.55 a.m. Um, um, right now we're in the ETH and um, I'm just going to point out some trades I'm, I'm looking at right now. So after after the news came out this morning at 8.30 we had this response right here. We had this big selling candle from approximately 49.53.50 to... Sweep ES. Uh, Sweep and Q. Absorption sellers and Q. Absorption sellers ES. Right, so the Sweep high of this, the high of this candle sellers was 49.58. Um, the low is 49.34. Absorption buyers and Q. And it opened at 49.58. So we had this big selling candle from from the news, and now we got this um, retracement here back up to the mid at 49.48, 75, and now we're moving Absorption down to sellers and Q. the central pivot range. Um, this is the trade amount for liquidity, and we're looking at liquidity here at 49.25 and 49.23. So I'm actually looking for a buy at this liquidity level here, so I'm thinking that we're going to get a bounce from this level because all of these um, pivots are in a higher value um, relationship today. The central pivot is in a higher value. Let me see if I could point that out. Right, so Sweet the central PS. pivot was here yesterday Sweet in the blue line. Central pivot BC is the green line right there. And um, today Sweet the RTY. central pivot is Absorption in a RTY. relationship right now. So that's the central pivot right there today. Also the Camarillas are in a higher value relationship as well. Let's see here. I know there's a lot on my chart, but um, I'm not going to take off much right now. I'm just going to kind of use the arrows and point out point out how these levels are higher value relationship. So the Camarilla yesterday was, um, the Camarilla R3 was here yesterday. Today it's at um, this level right here, which is 49.54.25 approximately. Camarilla S3 is here at 49.03.25. Just point that out right there. So that moved up, moved up above prior um, days Camarilla R3. So it's above that. So that's a higher value relationship right there. And um, we're basically looking for buys today. Now the sellers have taken control after the news. So we're going to keep an eye on that as well. Might have to flip Absorption to the Absorption sellers and Q. Absorption sellers and Q. Right, so sellers are... Uh, pushing down now on the central pivot range and um, I'm looking for some buys around this area here at the central pivot range along with the the liquidity here on um, Trader Map Pro at 49.23 so let's see here let's see what kind of Sweet we and get. Q. we're already getting a little bounce right there let me see let's go over to book map Right, so we're getting support here at roughly 49.27.50. Sweep RTY. Absorption RTY. Just below yesterday's close. So um, let's see, looking for probably a little failure here, or exhaustion of the buyers. And let them come down here and test like the value area low and the pivot TC. Right, so that's where the heavy liquidity is. Um, they're not pulling as yet. Liquidity is kind of stacked, stacked up around this area here. Right, this liquidity actually pulled, but we still have a bunch of liquidity in this area right here. All right, so this Sweet liquidity here just moved up on the, the bid.
and um, this white line here that's um that's the ym the red is the the russell and the green is the the nq so it's called a correlation tracker on um on bookmap so i could have these levels here to see what's happening in these um these other markets as well So it's looking like we're getting some support here. Um, let's see. Right, so we're creating some higher lows right now. Getting some support here again at 49. 30 we just broke that so we're going to come back down now and test this area here at 49 28 25 sweep yes got a nice sweep right there All right, and liquidity isn't really pulling from this area too much we had some liquidity pull from here this was 290 on the bid. Now it's at 101. So that liquidity did pull right there. We had some liquidity here. Same thing around 256. Now we're down to 88. Actually, I think these guys actually moved up a little bit. You see that yellow, that yellow line right there? They came from here and they kind of moved up. But no, I guess they Sweep were always RTY. right there. Absorption RTY. From this area, 147 on the bid. So now they're lightening up as well to 123. These guys here are increasing at 189 at 49.25. And this is this is where I'm trying to get a little reversal right here. So actually, let me open my trading platform. Absorption sellers and Q. Sweep and Q. Right, so we're getting some nice selling coming down here into the value area low and the uh, pivot TC. Um, this is Sweet the most buying you. I've seen here since um, we came down. We start coming down on these levels, these levels here. These sell buttons here, sell, sell bubbles, sorry. The sellers have been firmly in control coming down here. And um, this is the first set of buying. I've Absorption seen buyers and Q. Let's see if they're going to take this back up or if they get exhausted here again. Right, so we're coming back up here. They gotta test the top of this area if they're gonna break out. See on the trading platform here on trading view, it's at the second lower deviation band. That's usually where you start getting reversals. So um 
Let's see, let's move this down a little bit. This is no longer the overnight low. This is the overnight low. So we're starting to get some some stoppage here, some sideways movement. And that could be developing like a reversal pattern right there. All right, so that's basically my trade setups. Looking for some buys here, the central pivot, and then coming down to these levels. This is my market profile value area high on the weekly, 49.12.25. This is my market profile um, value area high. This is using the trade and view indicator. Absorption buyers and Q. For the market profile, I also have another indicator here, um, which shows Absorption the Absorption buyers zone. and Q. That has the value area high at 48.94.25, 23 roughly. And this is Camarilla S3 here at 49.03.41. Sweep and Q. So looking for buys in all these these areas right here. Camarilla S3 value area high Sweep on the Q. money zone. Absorption buyers and Q. This area right here as well. Weekly value area high. The market profile value area high. And also the central pivot range right here. Right now we're starting to get those first signs Sweet of a reversal Q. where we're starting to move sideways. Um, let's see, come back over here to book map. We actually broke the top, the top of the range right here at roughly 49.32. So let's see if they could maintain that. We test in here. They got to stay above this, at least this, this structure right here, this low at 49.29.25 and this should this should be where they stop right here and and continue the reversal if not it's gonna open up to test this level here at 49.29 and after that breaks we gotta come back and test the low at 49.26 25.75 and that's where I would want to take a buy right there. So that would be something like a, a little shakeout right there. Like this would be the preliminary stop. This is the selling climax, automatic rally, secondary test around this level here. And then we could take it back up. So let's see how it works out. That's my um, trade setup for this morning. We got um, right now it's 9.08. We got like about... 20 20 some minutes 22 minutes and um let's see how it goes all right y'all it's malak shalomo your trade safe and stay blessed